Hello everyone, my name is Matt Price, Senior Inside Systems Engineer with Veeam Software. Veeam delivers availability for the always-on enterprise by providing RTO and RPO, or what we call RTPO, of less than 15 minutes for all applications and data. Let's discuss how a few of our native tape support features help businesses manage data loss avoidance and maintain consistent availability. Let's take a more in-depth look at a few of these features in our lab. Now that we're in the lab, let's take a look at one of the new features we're going to be discussing today around native tape support, and that is parallel processing. To enable parallel processing, you simply need to create a new media pool or modify an existing media pool. Now you'll notice many of the same tabs still exist as did in previous versions of Veeam, the ability to select which tapes that you want to leverage per pool. If you want Veeam to bring in free tapes when they're needed, media set configuration, you've got job retention options on when to overwrite data if necessary, but what we really want to focus on is the options tab, which is where you can leverage parallel processing. Now the nice thing about parallel processing is you can have multiple concurrent streams going simultaneously that can take advantage of multiple drives to improve performance and reduce time. Now another thing that the parallel processing can do is take advantage of the per VM backup file chain jobs. And this actually lets you process separate chains in parallel using one media set per drive. Now that we've talked about parallel processing, let's move on to the next major enhancement that we've made around tape integration. And this deals with a global media pool. Now, one of the nice things about creating a global media pool is you can actually span this across multiple libraries. So if you notice, if we edit our archive pool, we go to our tapes tab and notice how our tape library shows multiple libraries where historically this was limited to a single library. So you'll notice we have a group of tapes from one library, and if we scroll down, there's actually a few tapes added in from a totally separate library. So by enabling the global media pool, you now have the ability to span data across multiple libraries to improve performance and management. And the last new feature we're gonna to discuss today around our native tape support deals with retention. One of the popular retention models is known as Grandfather, Father, Son, or GFS. Now Veeam has brought that to our native tape support. So if you'll notice, you now have the ability with your global media pool to actually implement a GFS-based policy. You can actually determine how many weeklies, monthlies, quarterlies, and yearlies you would like to retain on tape now in addition to disk so that you can leverage your tape investment further and reduce tape consumption. Now that you've seen how Veeam delivers data loss avoidance through native tape support to help you maintain availability, be sure to check out veeam.com for more information. Thanks for watching.